<laughs> this has got the fade. When it comes to sneakers, like this logo is probably still got about another hour left. Billy Hobbs shoe game. You'll have the Bengals logo on that one. Is on point. I'm 41 years old, so you know I remember when the original Air Jordan one came out, and that was kind of my thing. And I've been a sneakerhead ever since. For more than 15 years, he's been taking perfectly good shoes. Like I love custom. I love just the artwork and making them even better. Being able to take an old shoe that may be worth nothing to someone to turn it into, you know, a masterpiece for somebody. From low tops to high tops and everything in between. A Noah's Ark theme, Air Jordan 5, and it had um, uh, had different animal prints all over, the, all over the whole shoe. He's customized more pairs of kicks than he can count. Yeah, hundreds. I mean, hundreds and hundreds probably. So many shoes that he was able to quit his day job and go full time in his studio. Yeah, I worked for Pepsi Cola for 12 years and uh, actually had gotten to a point in the company where it was where everybody wants to be. And it was a hard decision to make, you know, but it was something where I was working 10 hours a day, eight hours a day at my day job and then coming home and working till midnight doing this. And that's when he traded in Pepsi for painting. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> His shoe art has attracted a who's who of footwear fanatics. I've done a pair for Coach Cal, um, Willie, um, you know, Tyler. I've had some relationship with Tyler. Uh, Trey Lyles still, he actually sent me a pair of shoes the other day to, to, to get some work done. Uh, Hall of Famer Andre Reed from the Buffalo Bills. Ian Kinsler from the Tigers. Jared Saltalamacchia. Many of the shoes Billy customizes are worn by athletes and then auctioned off to charities. The uh, Team Blake pair that I did for Willie. That was that was awesome just to be a part of that and the auction and raising some money for Cosairs. Most recently, a pair of 911 cleats Billy created for Tennessee Titans linebacker Avery Williamson gained national attention when the NFL threatened to fine Williamson for a uniform violation if he wore the custom cleats. I leaked them probably about a month early, not thinking any would anybody would pick it up. Little did I know that TMZ would pick it up and then the NFL saw that. The NFL would eventually back off its threat to fine. That, that was kind of a, a bad publicity for them to, to do that. But you don't have to be a pro athlete to lace up a pair of these True Blue Customs. I mean, I do shoes for 12 year old kids to, you know, 50 year old men to, you know, wh whoever. And as long as the sneaker enthusiasts are purchasing, Billy will be painting. I stay busy. I mean, it's it's nonstop. <laughs> In Lexington. You know, I'm doing something I love, so it's pretty awesome. Lee K. Howard, WKYT.